confiance et je tiens à vous exprimer ma profonde gratitude. C'est un grand honneur. C'est une grande responsabilité. Et c'est une responsabilité énorme. Car rien n'a été écrit en pierre. Je veux vous dire merci. Merci du fond du cœur. Ma gratitude va à tous ceux qui ont apporté leur suffrage. Ma gratitude est exprimée à tous ceux qui ont voté pour moi et qui m'ont soutenu. Je ne vous oublierai pas. Je ne vous oublierai pas. Je vous remettrai tout mon soin et toute mon énergie pour obtenir votre confiance. Et pour montrer que vous avez confiance en moi. Et maintenant, c'est à tous de nous, citoyens de notre pays, qui devons nous adresser cette lettre de remerciement. Je vous remercie pour votre confiance. 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 Bien des difficultés nous ont affaiblis depuis trop longtemps. Je ne me connais aucune difficulté ni les fractures économiques, ni les fractures sociales, 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 ni les fractures And it's my responsibility to hear them by protecting those who are the most fragile, by better organizing solidarity, by fighting against all forms of inequality or discrimination, by ensuring, in a resolute fashion, your safety, and by guaranteeing the unity of the nation. Because after all, under Between all these lines, everything I've said, I know that there are faces, men and women, children and families, entire lives. There you, there's you and your families. Tonight, it's to all of you that I'm addressing myself. All of you together, the French people. We have duties towards our country. We have inherited an extraordinary history and humanist message that was addressed to the world. And this history and this message have to be transmitted first of all to our children, but even more importantly, we have to really make sure that we carry them towards the future and to give them a new strength. I will defend France its vital interests, its images, its message, and I commit to this in front of you. I will defend Europe, the community that the peoples of our continent have set up, and it's our civilization that's at stake, our modus vivendi of being free, of carrying our values, our joint enterprises, and our hopes, and I will ensure a link between Europe and the peoples that create it, between Europe and its citizens. I am also, in your name, addressing the nations of the world and I'd like to say that we'd like to salute you fraternally. And I'd like to tell the leaders of the world that France will be present and will ensure peace, equilibrium of balance, international cooperation, commitments will be respected with regard to development and fight against climate change. And I'd like to say to everyone that France will be at the first row of the fight against terrorism on its land and also at an international level. As long as that fight will have to last, we will carry it out without weakening. My dear citizens, a new page of our history has been turned tonight, and I would like it to be that of hope and of trust. We found trust. The renewal of our public life will be opposed upon everyone from tomorrow, and our public life will become moral. Recognition of pluralism and democratic vitality from the first day will be really at the heart of my work. I will not allow myself to be stopped by any kind of obstacle. I will act with determination and respect each and every one of you, because after all, through work, through school, through culture, we will build a better future. French women, French men, my dear citizens, tonight I would like to salute President Hollande. For over five years, he worked for our country. And during the five years that will begin, my responsibility will be to try to calm fears and to try to reintroduce optimism, to find the spirit of conquer, which in fact 
defines a French genius. My responsibility will be to gather together all men and women ready to face the extraordinary challenges that we're going to face with and to act. Some of those challenges are an opportunity, for example, digital development, restarting off Europe, and others are threats, such as terrorism. And I will fight. I will fight with all my strength against the division that's been created and beats us down. And it's in that way that we will be able to give back to the French people, to every single one of you in your professional lives, in your personal and family lives, will give you the opportunities that France owe you. And let's love France from tonight and for the next five years. I am with humility and with devotion, with determination, I'm going to serve France in your name. Long live the Republic. Long live France.